Anirudh, Varun, and Tulsi Manchari. Hari Hari Bol. So let's start with prayers. Om Ajnana Timirandasya Jnananjana Shalakayam Chakshuran Militam Yena Tasmai Shri Gurave Namaham Nama Om Vishnu Padaya Krishna Prashtaya Bhutale Srimate Bhakti Vedanta Swamin Nitinamine Namaste Saraswate Deve Gauravani Pracharine Nirvisesha Shunyavadi Paschatya Deshatari name Yes, Sri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nityananda Sri Advaita Gadadara Sri Vasadi Gaura Bhakta Vrinda Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare who wants to chant 21 times of Maha Mantra? The Maha Mantra solves all the problems, personal, social, world level. If only people all chant the holy names of the Lord. But because they are not chanting, they are suffering. So we chant and we request Lord's mercy on all of us. Who wants to do the 21 times of chanting today? Mataji? Yes, we can. So you're going to chant. We are going to chant all the 16 words with focus and attention. And we are all going to chant along with you with the mute on. And also, what's the prayer we should have in the heart while chanting? Oh, Radha, oh, Krishna, please engage me in your shoes. Perfect, Vikya. Go ahead. Jai Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nityananda Shri Advaita Padathara Shri Vasadi Gaura Bhakta Vrinda Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare It was so nice, Vikyat. The vibration of the holy name, you chanting with devotion, was very nice. Thank you so much. Aditya has joined. Very good. We are missing Aditya and Srinidhi and Divyansh. Okay, so today we are going to do 15.7. But before that, what is the title of the 15th chapter?
Yes, Gauranga. The Yoga of the Supreme Person. The Yoga of the Supreme Person. Very good, Gauranga. Okay, so we did 15.1 and 15.5. So who can chant the first words of the 15th chapter, the shloka and the translation? Srinidhi, Srinidhi is joined, okay. Fifteen point one. Mataji can bar in the say. Yes, Balabinda. Udwa Buddha Shagam Ashwatam Braura Vyam Chantam Chias Yapar Nai. That's the way the same way. I want to say another one. Yeah. Can you say, can you read the translation if you have the book? Not this I don't have the book, but um, I think um, I, you can open the phone. I can open in the phone, okay? Mark, could you give me a minute? Okay, that was so nice, Mark. Okay, I found good. the translation. I'll read it. Mm -hmm. Okay, mommy, it's um, it's this one. Mm. The supreme person. The supreme personality of God is said it is said that there is an imperishable, imperishable banyan tree that has its root upward and its branches down and whole leaves are the Vedic hymns are uh, one who mm. knows the trees is no 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 knower of the Veda. Mm. Wonderful, Balajinda. Very, very nice. Thank you so much. That was so nice of you to say the shloka. Okay. Anyone else wants to say the first one? Gauranga. Yes, Gauranga. Mataji, can I? Yes, Varun. Okay, first Gauranga and then Varun. Bhagavan Vachan, Vodumulam Madhashtrakam, Ashwatam Prahuravayam, Chandam Siyasya Parnani, Yastam Veda Saveda Veda. Thank you, Gauranga. So beautiful. Varun? I think 14.1. Yes. <laughs> Very good. Thank you, Varun. Okay, who can say 15.5? Balabrinda, you know 15.5 also? Yes, Mataji, Nirmala Moha, Jisa Sangha Dosha, Adhyan Manityari, Nivitta Kava, Dandai Vabhukta, Sukha Dukha Sanjay, Vajanda Muda Padam Avyantar. Mataji, can I... um? Uh, read the translation. Yes, Bala Brinda, very, very good. Wonderful shloka recitation. Those who are free from... Those who are free from false prestige, illusion and false appearance, who understood the eternal, who are done with material, yeah. who are freed from the Duties of duality. duality of happiness and justice and who and will the and we will the known to have to surrender unto the supreme person attain to the eternal kingdom. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Palavrinda. Very good. Who else wanted to recite the shloka 15.5? Amataji. Yes, yes, Vikyat, go ahead. Nirmana Moha Jita Sangha Dosha. Adhyat Manitya Vinivritta Kama Dvandvair Vimukta Sukadukha Samgnair Gachant Yamudha Padama Vyayam Tat. Perfect, Vikyat. Thank you. So <clears throat> we saw in 15.1 how Krishna is explaining this whole world is like a reflected tree. The real tree is the spiritual world. And the reflected tree that is 
are reflected on the lake nearby is compared to the material world. And then the first five shlokas, he says how we need to cross over this uh, reflected tree and go to the real tree. Then in 15.5, he says, who actually can go to that kingdom? Who has all these qualities? Who's freed from false prestige, illusion, and false association? Who are not uh, bewildered by the dualities? Mm, who are always in association? So all those people and who knows how to surrender to the Supreme Lord, reach to that abode. Okay, so let's go to the next verse. Today I have Kahoot also. So you listen to the slides uh, very carefully. So most of the Kahoot is from the class today. Okay, so we will see 15.7 today. Mm, repeat after me. Mamai vam sho jiva loke. Mamai vam sho jiva loke. Ji mamai vam sho jiva loke. Mama Ivam Sho Jeeva Loke Jeeva Bhuta Sanatanaha Jeeva Bhuta Sanatanaha Jeeva Bhuta Sanatanaha Jeeva Bhuta Sanatanaha Manaha Sashtan Indriyani Mana Sashtan Indriyani Mana Shashtan Indriyani Mana Shashtan Indriyani Prakritistani Karshati Prakritistani Karshati Prakritistani Karshati Prakritistani Karshati Okay, let's recite this. Mamai vam sho jiva loke jiva bhuta sanatanaha. Mamai vam sho jiva loke jiva bhuta sanatana. Mana shashtani driyani prakritistani karshati. Mana shashtani driyani prakritistani karshati. Very good, Vikya. Anybody else wants to recite the shloka? Gauranga, yes, Gauranga. Mama Evam Sho Jeeva Loke Jeeva Bhuta Sanatana Mana Shashtan Indriyani Prakriti Stana Kashrati Beautiful Gauranga, very, very nice recitation. Wonderful. Okay, so we'll go to the synonyms. I'm going to ask you English and try to find out the equivalent Sanskrit. Uh, census. Indriyani. Good job, Vikyat. In the world of conditional life. Evalo. Uh, okay. Right. Good job, Vikyat. In material nature. Prakriti. Good job. Fragmental particle. Mama Eva Amsha. Oh, Amsha. Amsha. Good job. Uh, certainly. Eva. Eva. Very good. The six. Shastani. Shastani. Very good. With the mind. Mana. Good job, Vikyat. Good job, Gauranga. <coughs> Eternal? Nitya. Uh, no. oh, Sanatana. Sanatana. Good job. She is struggling hard. Karshati. Karshati. Okay. The conditioned living entity? Jeeva Bhuta. Jeeva Bhuta. Very good. Uh, the six. Shashtani. Shashtani. Okay. Situated. Shashtani. Shashtani. Very good. Okay. So let's do line, one line, and then you try to figure out what's the meaning by combining the meaning of the individual words. Mamai vamsho jiva loke. What's the meaning of this?
Um, my definitely my eternal parts and fragment. Uh, I definitely my fragmental particle in the material condition life. In the condition life, very good. Jiva Buddha Sanatanaha. Jeeva Bhuta Sanatanaha is, others can also answer. Yes, Gauranga. The condition living into the eternal. Very good. Mana Shastani Driyani. Can I try? Yes, yes, Garima. Ah, uh, oh, so, with the mind, the six senses in material nature. Okay, with the, uh, the six senses with the mind, right? That's the meaning of the third line. Okay, the fourth one. Prakriti stani kashati. Uh, that's situated in the material, uh, material nature. Uh, they are struggling hard. Wonderful, Vikya. Very good. So, um, uh, who wants to read the translation? Vikya, can you read the translation? Yes, Mataji. The living entities in this conditioned world are my eternal fragmental parts. Due to conditioned life, they are struggling very hard with the six senses, which include the mind. Very good. So, who, uh, whose parts are the living entities. Srinidhi? Yes, Mataji. Whose parts are the living entities? The, the Krishna's eternal fragment. Okay, very good, Krishna's. And what kind of parts are they? What are the adjectives that is given here? Did I answer this or? Uh, yes, yes, go ahead. Uh, fra fragmental parts. Yes, fragmental and eternal. Right? So that those are the two things that is mentioned here. Okay. Why, are, um, let me pick Avarun, can you answer? Why are they struggling hard? What did you want? Mataji, what did you say? Why are they struggling hard? They're struggling because the mind is controlling them. Good. Yes, they're struggling because the mind and the six senses are controlling. That means what? Here it is mentioned. Find out one word here that says why they're struggling. Yes, Gauranga? Due to condition life. Yes, due to conditioned life. In conditioned life, they're struggling. That means in liberated life also, are they struggling? No. No. In liberated life, they enjoy. But in conditioned life, they're struggling. They're struggling a little bit, right? That's what Krishna says. Is it, uh, is it so? I'm going to ask uh, Aditya Kasturi. Does Krishna say that they are struggling a little bit? Uh, it says that due to condition life, they're struggling very hard. Mm, very hard, right? Very hard. Not just a little bit. So who are this? Who are the living entities? All of us, right? All of us are in the conditioned world. All of our, all of us are eternal fragmental parts. And due to condition life, we are struggling very hard with the six senses, which include the mind. Mind is the most important thing. Okay. Uh, Srinidhi, can you read this? Okay, Mataji. The living entity is the fragmental part and parcel of the Supreme Lord eternally. Should we like all of them? Yeah. 
It is not that he assumes individually in his conditional life and in his liberated state becomes one with the Supreme Lord. He is eternally, eternally fragmented. It is clearly said, so not the no. Very good, Srinidhi. Okay, Tulsi Manjari, can you answer? Uh, say true or false, okay? The living entity in the conditional life uh, is individual being, but in the liberated state, he becomes one with the Supreme Lord. Is it true? I think she's not there. Okay, anyone can answer this. The statement is, yes, Vikya? False. False, very good. So here, Krishna is saying a very, very, very important point. Means we are all part and parcel of Krishna. So that means so, uh, a, a, a theory is that because we are in the conditional life, we are all having a material body and here we are individual beings. But then in the liberated state, all the parts come merged together one by one by one by one and becomes one with the supreme. But that is not right. Why that is not right? Because there is one word that is mentioned here. Can I say Mataji? Yes, go ahead. Fragmented. Uh, fragmented means it's part. Okay. But that doesn't say that uh, that this statement is false. That oh, or eternal. Mm, eternal, right? Sanatanaha. Sanatanaha, Tulsi Manjari, very good, yes. So what does that word mean? There is no, like you are, we, can, we can all celebrate our birthdays because there is a day on which the body has taken birth. But is there a day in which the soul has become, has been, uh, become or, uh, is is uh, is a became a part of the Lord. Is there a day that we can celebrate Soul Day, Soul Birthday? No, Mother. Why, Gauranga? Because the body has left the world. Because the soul is eternal. Yes, the soul is eternal. What's the meaning of eternal? It never dies. Okay, that's one meaning. But there's one more. Uh, it was never it, born. Ah, immortal means it never dies, right? But eternal is Na jayate. Na jayate means it's not born. Na mriyate is, is not, uh, it's not, doesn't die. But what is the word eternal? It's without beginning or end. Is without a beginning or end, right? So if you Google what's the meaning of eternal, that means lasting or existing forever without end or beginning. So there is no particular day when the soul was had become a part of Krishna, right? So there's no day because eternally, without an end, without the beginning, there is no day when Krishna became God. There is no day like that. There is no time calculation. So similarly, there is no beginning or end. So every, although, uh, eternally, whether a, whether a soul is conditioned or liberated, he is said to be eternally the part and parcel of the Lord. So that is why this statement holds true because if if it if the statements hold true that the con in the conditional life the soul has taken individuality, but in the liberated state he becomes one with the Lord. 
then there won't be the need of this word eternally because in the future is going to become one so how can we say that he is eternally the fragmental part so that is the argument so that means there is no end there is no beginning of when the soul became a part of the lord and always the soul is an individual part so remember this this will be a covered question okay uh tulsi manjari do you want to read this okay can i read this um yeah i called on tulsi manjari maybe the next slide you can read go ahead tulsi the supreme one manifests and expands himself in innumerable expansions of which the primary expansions are called vishnu tattva and the secondary expansions are called the living entities yeah continue okay the vishnu tattva is the personal expansion and the living entities are the separated expansions by his personal expansion he manifested in various forms like lord rama and narasimha dev vishnu murti and all the predominating deities in the vaikuntha planets the separated expansions the living entities are eternally servitors thank you tulasi okay my question to open question to all anyone can answer what are the two kinds of expansions of the lord can i answer mataki this is prahlad yes prahlad uh, i the new it's the innumerable expansions and the primary expansions uh you're partly right and this and the secondary expansions yes so expansions are innumerable but there are of two types the primary expansion and the secondary expansion so can you um, can anyone give some examples of primary expansions for drama narasimha dev what do you mean a primary expansions so primary expansions are called vishnu tattva when krishna takes an incarnation as narsingha dev or varaha dev or this is a kurma dev this is matsya avatar this is kalki this is krishna and balaram has come this is lord ramachandra this is bhrugupati so these are all expansions of the lord because he has come right so they are all having the same potency as the lord so they are called primary expansions the incarnations of the lord are called primary expansions or rather way they are called vishnu tattva okay good uh, answer uh, vikyat okay so according to the slide what is the difference in function or activity between the primary expansions <coughs> and secondary expansions did you get my question anyone can answer this according to these three the answer is in these three points what is the difference in function um of the uh... the separated expansions are eternally servitors very good and the primary expansions are um are also uh, servitors no they served. are the lords right they are served very good so the primary expansions are predominating deities or the lord and the secondary expansions that is the living entities are all eternally servitors okay so this is the two so we are also part of krishna right how are we the part of krishna and how are we different from the incarnations who are expansions of krishna so this is the point shila prabhupada is saying first is primary expansions they are none other than incarnations who come for different purposes and secondary expansions are the living entities but primary expansions are the lord himself but secondary expansions are always servitors that's the main difference okay 
So we know this is Vishnu Murti. Vishnu is expanding here as Karbodakashaya Vishnu. Then we know how Dashikati came according to the boon of uh, Lord Brahma and Sita Rav Lakshman Hanuman. <laughs> how he came as a human being and then he killed Ravana. Okay, so uh, let's read this slide carefully. Who wants to read? Can I read Mataji? This is Prahlad. Yes, Prahlad, go ahead. As fragmental parts and parcels of the Supreme Lord, the living entity also have fragmental portions of his qualities of which independence is one. You can continue reading all the three points. Okay. Every living entity as an individual soul from his, has his personal individuality and a minute form of independence. By misuse of that independence, one becomes a conditioned soul and by proper use of independence is always liberated. In his, should I read this? Yes, yes. In his liberated state, he is freed from the, this material condition and he is under the engagement of transcendental service unto the Lord. In his conditioned life, he is dominated by the material modes of nature and he forgets the transcendental loving service of the Lord. Thank you, Prahlad. So, um, what happens when we misuse the independence? We become conditioned so. Very good, Gauranga. So why do we have independence? Yes, Gauranga? Because it's Krishna's independence. Yes, Gauranga. So Krishna is a supremely independent and we are his small fragmental portion. So we are all, we also have minute independence, not supreme independence, a little form of independence. But by misuse of that, we become conditioned soul. But we properly use that independence means always saying to Krishna that I want to surrender to you and surrendering to him, then we become liberated. Okay, in which life are we dominated by the material modes of nature? In which state? In the conditioned state or in the liberated state? The conditioned state. Very good. The conditioned state, we are dominated by the material modes. But in the liberated state, we always render service to the Lord. So that is just this independence. You can, I want to surrender this independence to Krishna and follow his instructions, then we become liberated. But if we don't want to surrender to Krishna, then we take life after life after life after life. And also, it's very hard. So what happens uh, when we when we are taking life after life? Is it an easy one? Okay, those uh, somebody who has not read so far, can you read this? Mataji, can I? Yes, Varun. <clears throat> the word karshati, struggling or grappling hard, is very significant. Conditioned soul is bound up as though shackled by iron chains. He is bound up by the false ego, and the mind is the chief agent which is driving him in this material existence. When the mind is in the mode of goodness, his activities are good. When the mind is in the mode of passion, his activities are troublesome. And when the mind is in the mode of ignorance, he travels to the lower species of life. It is clear, however, in this verse, that the conditioned soul is covered by the material body with the mind and the senses, and when he is liberated, this material covering perishes, but his spiritual body manifests itself in individual capacity. Thank you, Varun. So what's the word, uh, Sanskrit word for struggling or grappling hard? Uh, 
Uh, yeah, it's Karshati. Can I? It's Karshati. Okay, Karshati. Yes, Karshati. So, uh, so we are struggling very hard. But why should we struggle? What is the main thing that is causing us to struggle? We are actually looks like we are enjoying, right? We can see. It's, it's the attachment to the material nature. Okay, that's good. But uh, yeah, can you find out the answer from these coins? Uh, he's bound up by, uh, by the false ego. Yes, false ego. We think that I am the mighty Pralat. I am mighty this. I am mighty that, right? We always think like that. That is, that is a false ego. And the mind. The mind is the chief agent. Mind is telling us, okay, see this. Go here. Play here. Mind is always driving us to do one thing or the other. Okay, so mm, when, when the mind is in which mode do we travel, uh, do we go to the lower species of life or we become a lower species of life? Ignorance. Ignorance. Very good, Anirudh. Yes. But uh, when the mind is in, uh, when the activities are troublesome, then the mind is in which mode? Passion. Passion, right. And when the activities are good, the mind is in the mode of goodness. Okay. So when uh, this is all happening in the material world, it's like this. Have you seen scuba diving? I wanted to put the picture. I forgot. So somebody diving underneath the sea and then in the submarine. So how, uh, how will they wear, uh, will they just go like that under, under the sea or what will they have? What will they wear specially? Do you know what they will wear? A swimsuit. Yes. That is swimsuit for swimming, but for people who spend a lot of time underneath the water, doing some work, fixing pipes or doing other things, they need to be able to breathe, right? They use oxygen tanks. Yes, they use, a, they use another uh, suit, submarine suit that will help them breathe. And so, you know, they don't have to suffocate under uh, water, under the water. So they use that suit. And once they come up outside, what happened? Do they still use the suit? When their work is finished, when they come up to the uh, shore. So they remove that, right? Because they don't need any ox special suit for oxygen because they're not underwater. So similarly, the material, if we are um, a conditioned living entities and we have this material body, mind and senses, it's all like a, a underwater suit. But when we get liberated, we go to Krishna, then we don't need this material body, mind and senses as much as the diver when he comes up, he doesn't need the suit anymore. He's in his natural condition, he can breathe air, right? So similarly, the spiritual body is awakened. You see, when he's liberated, what body comes? Spiritual body. He's still an individual being, but instead of material body, there is a spiritual body. Okay, the last slide. Anirudh, do you want to read? Yes, Mataji. Do I just read the first bullet or both of them? No, both of them. Okay. The fragmental portion is eternal. It is also stated in the beginning of the second chapter that in each and every individual body, the fragment portion of the Supreme Lord is present. That fragment portion, when liberated from the bodily entanglement, revives its original spiritual body in the spiritual sky and a spiritual planet 
and enjoys association, association with the Supreme Lord. It is, however, understood here that a living entity, being the fragmental part and parcel of the Supreme Lord, is qualitatively one with the Lord, just as parts and parcels of the gold are also gold. Thank you, Anirudh. So here in the uh, second chapter, does it, anyone know the shloka, Dehi no Svinyata Dehi? Mataji, I do. Yeah, go ahead. Dehi no Svinyata Dehi, Gorma Ram Yoga Nam Jaratata Dehantara, Prapandira Satvina Mohyati. Thank you, Varun. Okay, so this means that Krishna is saying that the one inside the body is uh, goes from this body from boyhood to youth to old age and same way he goes to another body at death okay so, so what is the example uh, of gold here given for what to explain what uh, concept Okay, maybe I'll explain that. So the Supreme Lord is considered to be a gold mine. You see, there is a mine of gold. And then from the gold is mined. And then from the gold, there are many ornaments and uh, jewelry are made. Both are gold, right? Both are gold. But the quantity with which this jewelry is made is very less compared to the quantity in the mine of gold. So although they are qualitatively gold, in quantity, this gold is much, much more value than this gold, right? At least, you know, in a gold mine, you can, uh, you can still value the gold in the gold mine. But with the Lord, Lord is compared here to the gold mine and he's unlimited. And we are part and parcel of the Lord, but we are limited. Okay? We are the same quality as God. Just like this gold and the gold mine are the same, but the quantity is different. Do you understand? Okay, so this is a very important concept. So we saw how there is a soul and the soul is eternal. So there is no soul birthday. Like we have birthday for the body, there is no birthday for the soul. Because the soul, there is no beginning and end, continues to live. Then we saw there are two expansions, primary and secondary. Primary are Vishnu Tattva and they are the lords. And secondary expansions are Jiva Tattva and they are servants. So these are examples of primary. And then what happened? Why the secondary expansions are suffering? Because of the misuse of the minute independence. So if we are properly using that independence to surrender to the Lord, then we go back to the Lord. But if you are not misusing that independence, then the mind drags us from one uh, body, one life to another life to another life, and it continues like this. Okay? And that's why the fragmental part means the living entities of the same quality as the Supreme Lord, but not the same quantity. Okay, so ready for Kahoot now? Can we play Kahoot or is it too late? Who is answering? Who wants Kahoot? Me. Okay, so for a while I'm starting the Kahoot. Okay, I'm sharing the screen for the screen. Gain pin. The gain pin is 
Uh, so we have Vikyat, Varun, Srinidhi, Gauranga, Dasa, Anirad, Aditya. One, two, three, four, five, six people have joined. Aditya Kasturi. Aditya Rajiv has not joined today. Mataji, what's the pin? Mataji, I'm still joining. Please wait. I'm... Okay, 3788011. Mataji, Mataji, my brother couldn't join today. Your brother didn't join? Yeah, he couldn't join today. Okay, tell him I missed him. Okay. Oh, okay. he just came back. He's joining right now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's nice. Okay, we have one, two, three, four, five, six people. And Prahalad is joining. I am the God. I'm the, I'm the, the first. Oh, you're the God? No, you're the part of God, right? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Not kidding. That's the reality. So, uh, who else? That's it? Okay, shall we start? It's already late. We'll start. Five, six, seven. Okay, one person can join. So it's 15.7. So this is the previous verse, 15.5. You need to find the missing line. Nirmana moha jita sangha dosha adhyatma nitya vinitritta kamaha Wow, all the six gave the right answer. That's wonderful. Let's see Aditya Kasturi, Varun, Gauranga, Anirudh, and Vikyat are on the scoreboard. The second question, the living entities are... Lots, eternal parts. Wow, almost everyone got it right. Good job. Yes, Aditya, Varun, Vik, Gauranga, and the God. Okay, the next one. The word that shows that living entities are eternally fragmented is, what is that word? We saw that word in the slide. Yes, five of you got it right. Yes, it is sanatanaha. That's very important. That means eternal. There is no end. There is no beginning. Okay, good. Vikyat is leading. Gauranga is there. The second place. Okay, fourth. The primary expansions of the Lord are called... Wonderful, yes, called Vishnu Tattva. Good job, everyone. The next fifth question, the living entities are not secondary expansions. It's true or false? Six of you got it right. Yes, they are the secondary expansions, right? It's a little tricky one. Okay. Let's go to the next question. That is the sixth question. The living entities are eternally 
very easy question. Mataji, it kicked me out. Oh, really? How come? I don't know. It just said that you left and then you got disconnected. Oh, join back again. You see the game uh, pin is 3788011. And I don't know if the score will be there. So are you joining back? We'll wait for you. You can start, Mataji. I'll come. Okay. okay. Yeah. The, like okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So let's go to the next question. Seventh question. By misuse of independence, the living entity becomes a liberated soul. Everyone got it right. That's great. Yes. By misuse, we become the conditioned soul. Gauranga has count the next level. Okay, let's see. Vikyat has a streak of seven correct answers. Eighth question. Dash is the chief agent which is driving us in the our material existence. Seven of you got it right. Yes, it's the mind, the magic mind. Good job, Vikyat. Okay, let's go to the next question. Aditya K has eight correct answers. So ninth question, with the six senses, the living entity is enjoying in the material world. Seeing TV shows, playing video games, seeing WhatsApp messages, seeing Facebook messages. Right, five people got it right. Is a living entity enjoying or what's what's what is it doing in the material world? Suffering. Suffering, yes. So suffering in the material world. Okay. So Aditya K has come. Tulsi has got the answer streak of four. Tenth question. When the living entity is liberated, he revives his original. Wow, all the seven of you got it right. Yes, it revives a spiritual body. Okay, let's see who's in the podium. Vikyat is in third position. He got 10 out of 10. Gauranga is in the second, 10 out of 10. And Aditya Kasturi is in the first position. Wonderful. Runners up are Varun and the God. Okay, good job, kids. Okay, so let's uh, let me stop it. Okay, thank you for joining. Do you have any questions? No? Okay, so this is a memorization verse for the next class. We will do the first question on Kahoot will be this for the 15.7 and meet you all again next week. Thank you all very much for joining. Sheila Thank Tomkaki. you, Mataji. Jai. Jai. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna, Mataji. Hare Krishna, Mataji. Hare Krishna. Krishna. Thank, Thank you. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna.